Hi, so you all know that Unreal Engine default VR template movement setup is kind of a teleport system. So you press a button and a point will show on the floor and you just teleport there. So today I made some changes on the template. Now I can normally walk with the thumbstick and go wherever I want with the camera view as like a real life. Okay, so let me show you how I made this one. So first of all, launch your Unreal Engine from Epic Game Launcher. After that, it will show like this. Now you need to go to Games. You need to go to Virtual Reality. Now on the project location, uh, I will change the location up here. Like yeah, select folder. Now I need to put a project name here. So VR Showcase uh, UE55 means Unreal Engine 5.5. .5. Now create. Okay, so the, our project is ready now. Okay. After that, we need to go to our content drawer. Now, fear template. Now, go to input. Now, go to action. You see, there is some action already, some action mapping here. So, we will be need to create some action map here. So, input, input action. So, I will name this one input action. I mean, IA underscore control move, maybe control move. Okay, so control mode. I'll open this one. Now here I need to change the value type to digital boolean to access 2D like vector 2D. Now on the modifiers tab I need to add a modifier like I need to add a dead zone. So you know the thumbstick has some dead zone like it will start with the point 2 and it will go up to 1, 1 min full. Okay. So this is done. After that, I need to create another one. So this is for the looking left and right. So go to input, input action, IA underscore. Okay, so this is control left and right. So this one will be axis 1D. So this will be only X axis only in X axis. That's it. So it will be access 1D. Uh, we need to add a modifier here also. So it dead zone. So it will start on point 2 and end on the full. Okay, save. Now go to here. Now open up the IMC default. Expand this one. Now just add new mapping. Uh, IA underscore. I think control move. Yeah, this is the first one. Control move. So today I will be using a meta quest tree. So this will be Oculus touch and L thumbstick. Uh, yeah, this one. M th L thumbstick to the axis. L for lift. Okay, we need to add another mapping. So this will be I A underscore. This one control left right. Okay. So this one will be on the I will walk with the left controller, like left control thumbstick, and I will look left or right with the right controller thumbstick. So this will be Oculus touch. Go to right and this will be just only X axis, like this axis, you see? This now save. Okay, now we need to go to content, VR template, blueprint. So there is a VR pawn. Okay, so this is a VR pawn. Now, this is currently a pawn. We need to change this to the character. So go to class settings. Uh, the parent class, change the parent class to, what is the character? Character. Character, yeah. Okay, it's done. After that, we need to change the rotation mode also. Why is the rotation one here? Here, yeah. We need to uncheck this one. Use controller rotation. Yeah. Now compile, save, go to viewport. Okay. So I will click the camera. Okay. So the camera will be like uh here maybe. Okay. And we will click. We will click this one, VR origin. I will go around like maybe this much. Uh, okay, yeah, this looks fine. Compile, save. 
now this is the now this is the original part now you need to go to event graph you need to delete this one the snap turn and the teleport so i will just delete this one or i can just disconnect it so it won't work so and i need to disconnect this one as well so in protection move teleport okay so this is done so this is our empty space okay so input input action now which one did we make yeah i think control move this one so we'll hit this one expand now we need to add character movement so just add movement input yeah this one okay so this is done now we need to get the forward vector from the camera so get forward vector yeah this on camera okay so after that we need to just split this one action value split struck pin okay good we need a multiplier multiply yeah, we need actually two multiplier okay good we need to split this one as well the world direction oh sorry just split okay it's done now we need to split this one as well okay good 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 now first we need to multiply the return x value with the action value y like this one uh, did i did it right uh, yeah this is right okay after that we need to multiply the y value the like return y value with the action value y now just connect the struct pin the first one on the world world direction x and the second one will be the world direction y okay so this is done for the left controller joystick we can move around with this one so this is done oh uh, on the scale value so how fast you want to move so i will put like 0.2 for some realistic movement done now for this one uh as a control left right yeah this one we need to add actor world rotation this one just struck the rotation pin now take the action value and oh i need to take a multiplier first we need to multiply it then it will be connected to the z value okay so so for how fast you want to move left and right this is the value so i will put 0.5 over here so now compile save everything uh, this is done now with this one you can just easily walk around in your vr headset and try it with new environment also yeah bye